Hey guys, hope you're doing well. Uh, it's Wednesday. <laughs> uh, I'm doing good. I guess as good as I can be, I think. No, I can always be better, right? I, th I just wanted to, uh, I'm gonna tell you a story. We're drawing again. I'm getting really creative this time. Okay, so I'm going to try to make this short. I'm not an artist, so this is going to be like very rudimentary. But I want to just tell the story. That's what this is about. Okay, so once upon a time in a land far away uh, where there's lots of hopelessness and better people and lots of hopelessness. Uh, there was a school. Uh, I make this, like I said, very rudimentary, guys. Gonna have to overhang. Okay. Uh, I don't think that's, <laughs> I don't know how you spell school. Wow. I need to restart. Okay, that's embarrassing. That's embarrassing that I forgot how to spell school. I don't, I don't, uh, it's weird when you like, th you, you think of a word and then, uh, you start thinking about it a lot and then it starts sounding weird, right? It's kind of like that. I haven't written it in so long. I haven't written anything. I'm like, wow. It reminded me of when I was in the spelling bee in the fifth grade. And I was, I felt that was smart. I feel stupid now. I'll go over that later. Because, uh, you know, I actually, in high school, I actually started taking classes and got like independent studies because of my mental issues. But anyways, uh, fifth grade, spelling bee, I misspelled specific. S P E C. I F I C. I think, wow, it's so bad. Uh, but you're nervous when you're in front of people. Anyways, yeah, so instead of faking it and just making my life perfect, here's me fucking up because I'm, I'm fucked up. And it, that this required some thought. That's how out of touch with reality. I'm not out of touch with reality, but I haven't been in society in a long time. Wow. So, uh. Anyways, uh, this is a little retarded school. <laughs> yeah. Gonna make it like retarded. Okay. Yeah, I did that on purpose. And you gotta have it like, obviously the, the, the probably two double door, or two double, or two doors, I would assume. And then, the front of a school. I don't know. Okay, and then there's like a bell. Yeah, let's put a little bell. Yeah, that's a. No, okay, so that looks like a. There's six, there's three, there's nine, so 11, 10, 1, 2, 4, 5, 7, 8. I don't know why I did it like this, but, uh, so, uh, man, I'm fucking crazy and retarded. So once it's on time, there was a, uh, a school and they had a carnival every year where they would invite, it's like a carnival, I don't know what to say. They'd have like games like at a fair where you like toss a dime and try to land it on a little plate and win a goldfish, things like that. Or throw a football through a tire. Or, you know, shoot a basketball through a hoop that's been bent so fucked up that it's almost impossible. It is impossible. So, uh, they had stuff like that. They had the police come and do the dare stuff, teaching about drugs and whatnot. And in order to get these things, like, to have access to them, you had to buy tickets. And I, I think they would have done it every year. I just remember the... This particular person who is, uh, I can't say if it's me or not, 
was at the, yeah, and they were giving away these raffle ticket things. And trying to make it look as accurate as possible. Uh, the retarded, because you are retarded, Sienna. Okay, so, uh, thank you from what these are. I remember tickets are kind of like this. And they're probably like 50 cents for a dollar each. Okay. And I think they're probably red too. So let's go ahead and make it red. That's magenta. Well, it's close enough because I'm only going to lightly do it. This story is going on too long. Okay, so they had these little tickets, and you could buy them in order to, like, I don't think they're rides, but they're an amusement. And they're expensive. So they would have, like, a, a art contest. So how do we put this? A little easel here, and then uh, Mona Lisa. I don't know what Mona Lisa looks like, but uh, let's just say this is Mona Lisa, and this is the art contest. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so there's the Mona Lisa uh, art contest. Um... So, uh, the boy's mom, who definitely, uh, probably, I'm not sure it was not me, uh, decided to buy some poster boards because he had to do it on a big poster board. So, uh, yeah, she was really nice. Yeah, thinking back, uh, that boy caused his mom a lot of problems. Because he had emotional issues. He doesn't know why. He's not really around. At least not seen anymore. <clears throat> yeah, it's weird thinking back though. So, uh, his mom bought him. Some posters. Glass hands. I started drawing on it. This is a colored pencil, kind of like the one I have right here. And he's working really hard. And this is the back of his head. Let's pretend uh, he's got a baseball cap on. Because about that time, he probably did wear baseball caps. He really liked the Green Bay Packers. Yeah. So we're going to make a little Green Bay thing. Green Bay. I don't even know what that looks like anymore. So uh, there's a Green Bay. Yeah. So he's wearing a hat and he's drawing. Like a little whatever. Yeah, right? And he's a uh... yeah, yeah, yeah. And he's happy. He's excited. It's like there's, there's the winners get tickets. He's, he saw it. He saw it. The first grader saw it. 
the winner, first place, gets 50 tickets. Wow. I don't know what second and third place got. I don't know how many it was. Not so much enthusiasm for these. It just kind of tapers off. Yeah. <laughs> Ticket. <laughs> yeah, that's probably right. Let's do like that. Yeah. Just for and giggles. Okay. <laughs> So he's drawing, 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 and I don't know what he's drawing, but it's probably something, it has something to do with the carnival. And he's drawing this happy guy, it was probably a clown, and he was like, happy. That's made of real eyes. Uh-huh. And uh, a nose. Hey, and he had a little stick figureness to him. It's just like me. Uh, and he was drawing, and he started drawing the hands because he doesn't know how to draw people well. Oh shit. Uh, he messed up. He messed up. And I think his mom only bought one poster board. And he was upset. And he started crying. Because he thought that he lost. He thought that it was over. He wanted those tickets so bad because his parents didn't make a lot of money at the time. Or something along those lines because they didn't want to buy tickets. They're expensive. And he was sad. And, uh, he wanted to give up because he saw his mistake and it was probably done in a permanent marker and, uh, couldn't be undone. But then, uh, his mom. And my mom's hair doesn't look like this. So I'm just trying to draw a like, girly type hair. Six figureness. Um, I don't know what she'd say. Put a big smile on her face. Um, probably something like this. And so he got busy.
Mm-hmm. I'm sorry, this is taking so long, guys. I'm trying to hurry here. Cap done and uh, where's my black colored pencil? Okay, it's right here. It's clarified this is the poster. I don't know what else was on it, but yeah, that's the poster board. And then uh, what happened was something like this. I don't know how to rake these. Yes, I do. I can do, be creative too. Okay, I just need to believe in myself. What do you expect, guys? Like I said, I'm slow, whatever that means. and bought colored pencil. Wow. Right here, blending into the couch. South Park Hampton. Uh-huh.
<laughs> this is make this easy. Wow, my brain's getting ahead of me there. There you go. Wow. I guess I need to eat. <laughs> Thanks, guys. You can do it. Don't ever give up.